the other thing I want to just demonstrate is basically the super trochlear nerve and the super orbital nerve. Um, and, it, and again, that comes out just right above the eyebrow. You can actually feel the, uh, the foramen. And, um, and, and essentially, um, both of these nerves then will do an anesthesia for the entire forehead as well as the, uh, the, the muscles. The indications for this procedure may include repairing lacerations of the forehead, debridement of burns or cleaning abrasions of the forehead, pain relief for shingles, relief of postherpetic itching, pain relief of supraorbital or supratrochlear neuralgia. The equipment you will need includes a 3 to 5 milliliters syringe, 2% lidocaine or 0.5% bupivacaine, an 18-gauge needle for drawing up medication, a 1.5-inch, 25 or 27-gauge needle for anesthetic injection, gloves, gauze, and betadine or chlorhexidine antiseptics. Um, after sterile preparation, then what I will do is I generally just um, take um, my needle and I inject in a fanning motion I just go straight across and I get both nerves um, as I inject. I, I move fast. In general, the recommendations is to aspirate, but uh, there, since I'm moving fairly fast back and forth, I, I don't aspirate routinely. But then this, again, gets the supratrochlear nerve and the superorbital nerve, and that'll give you anesthesia to the forehead.